What's up, everyone? Happy Monday or whenever the hell you happen to be listening to this. I will start out saying that we did finally learn something really, really, really big at the Circuit of the Americas in Austin, Texas at CODA this weekend with the NASCAR Craftsman Truck Xfinity and Cup Series. Not all the things that we learned were good things, but there's one really, really, really you know, big thing that has to be discussed. But before we get to that, because there's so much bulldozing, we knew there was no lack of respect. But shout-outs go to Joey Logano and Brad Kozlowski for how they raced each other last week and nice and clean, and then Tyler Reddick and William Byron from CODA, showing that you can actually respect someone and race them clean and not just bulldoze through them, which is all we normally see anyway. But the real big thing, and something that a lot of us have felt for a long time, and that is the stage end cautions need to go, and they need to go yesterday. And I did condone them at certain times because let's say the Coca-Cola 600 a few years ago when Martin Truex won, and I think he led 588 of the 600 miles and it was just, you know, just follow the leader, at least a bunch of everyone else. We got to see some kind of racing that wasn't, you know, right on top of each other. You know, it was like Reddick yesterday. No amount of strategy anywhere was going to stop him, but you know, it could have caused something and you know, they need to get rid of them. Uh, Wholeheartedly agree. Like, this is what they should have done with them in the first place, how they did it this weekend. And I'll be one of the first ones to say that, you know, we see the grand scheme for TV and it gives them more time for breaks and, you know, whatever. You know, that does help, but it doesn't help the racing. And it took so much strategy. And all you had to do is watch the truck race to understand how much it hurt racing, like the actual racing, racing as a whole. Because there was, like, no strategy. He's always got to make it to the end of this. Bang, we all get to pit. And that really hurt the racing. Now, I will say, I thought they should have been, you know, the stage ending caution should have been dropped from road courses for a while. And anyone that watched the road races, all y'all should be able to, you know, understand. You know, especially in the cup, you know, guys, with the cup guys going down to the Xfinity and the truck series. Like, they should have been gone, you know, at the road courses. Really, they never should have happened because when you saw the guys from the top levels, you know, go down or people that just needed to get a win in general because they were having, you know, an off year or just had a bunch of bad luck. In the road courses, what did we see last year? They would pit, you know, what right before pit lane closed. They'd get their stuff. Everyone, all the regulars went for stage points, you know, that was going for them. And then when the pits would, you know, happen during the stage end caution, those people would all get shuffled to the back. And the non-regulars would get shot to the front, not the people that were consistently running good, even though some of those guys that pitted early from the major series, they're running good. But, you know, there's two strategies at road courses. Pit right before it, so you get, you know, track, you know, position. You get way farther up there on the lineup when they start again, or you get the stage points. There was no in-between, and that took a lot out of it and right there it proved it it really really did this week and just seeing the different strategies even though they all didn't work out people you know did different things like you know kyle bush in the truck series he was trying to run it out a few more laps just to make sure after everyone already hit and then caution comes out he's the only one that really has to go boom he gets caught in, you know in trouble so did it bite people like kyle bush yes but was it nice to see more than just pit right before or pit during you know, depending on, you know, what you were going for, either stage points for the overall or you were just there for the win, like the non-regulars would be. And it most certainly screwed them. But was it nice to see it? You bet your ass it was nice to see it. Pardon my French, but you bet your ass. That was that was fantastic just to see something different. Again, I hated them doing them on you know, road courses again just because of that. There were other races where you're going, eh. You know, especially tracks where tire wear was paramount. And, you know, like, they're just, well, we got to make it here. If you took that away and still gave the points, you know, it would put something else in there and less people would be pissed off. And if you think about it in the grand scheme of things, again, tell me what you want. Comments, voice message on Spotify for podcasts, formerly known as Anchor. Like, you can find all of that. You know, let me know what you think. But, you know, we did get to see more intense racing there to get those stage points just because of the big difference, you know, even just one of them can end up making in the grand scheme of things like we've seen through the years. But you could still give them out while they keep racing, not stop anything, and everyone can still do strategy. 
and, you know, get points and go for the win and do all of those things and make it, you know, complete racing again. That's the biggest problem that a lot of people have had, whether it's fuel strategy, tires, any sort of anything. You're just trying to hit out of cycle and sequence of everyone else. That's okay. That is what, you know, people used to do to win championships, races, all kinds of things, and we've really gotten away from it. And the fans have been complaining long enough. Again, I get the stage thing. Yeah, but a lot of them, you know, it took a lot of the strategy away in the grand scheme. No matter what you feel about them, if you love them, it does take strategy away, and we don't need the caution there. You can still do stages, stage points, whatever. You know, give people stuff for still running up there in the top 10 that whole time. That's okay. You know, people will race for those points because every point matters. But, you know, the caution, that needs to go. And if you got anything from Coda minus that, you know, Two people race with respect over it, yeah, you know, with Reddick and Byron, and most of the field just bulldoze the hell out of everybody. If you get away from that, and even with those included, the biggest thing that we got out of there is that we need to get rid of those. I say get rid of them everywhere. I think most people agree. Again, let me know what you think, but I think those need to go very far away, very, very fast, because they do nothing but just take what makes racing racing, you know, out of it. It's supposed to be in this big thing, you know, what's the point of having you know, these engineers and all these things that can figure out, you know, fuel down to the lap, you know, and what they need to do and tires and all that. But it doesn't matter because, you know, everyone just waits till the stage and they pit then and it takes all that away. So hopefully they do. Um, <laughs> we'll see what they do. You know, as we all know, I really, most of us actually, I won't even just speak for myself. A lot of us don't have faith in NASCAR to do anything that makes a load of damn sense or anything that people, you know, really want and they could get both again they could have the stage points and exciting racing people trying to stay up there because those points do again matter in the long run i hate to sound like a broken record but they do and you could also you know not have the caution at the end which throw a strategy back in there we'll see i have no faith in them to do it but hopefully we'll get it you know they'll come out and be like yep yeah, what we've decided we heard you and they do something i i don't think they will right away but it proved the point of what we've all been saying for a very long time. So we'll see, but thank you for checking it out. You know, don't forget to check out the rest of the stuff from the racing action from across the week. And with all the series and NASCAR, we got super cross. Now, a lot of stuff out there. Let me know what you think in the comments, go to Spotify for podcasters link. You know, that episode, you can leave a voice message for me. You can also support the show and helps out immensely or on YouTube. Rumble, Apple Podcasts, Spotify, all of those. I appreciate you all. Check everything out. Share the hell out of it because it helps so much. And until we meet again, everyone, peace. I'm out. Bye.